Let's model this chair in SketchUp on iPad. A rectangle 2 by 2 feet. Push pull tool to give it a height of 1 feet 4 inches. This box is just for reference. Some markings with pencil tool to locate midpoints of faces. Select and group so that it cannot interfere with other geometry that we create. With the midpoint as center, create a circle till this corner. Delete its face. With red axis selected, create another circle of 0.7 inches. Select both circles and group. Make another circle on back side. Keep a copy aside. Now repeat the steps for back circle also. For seat, make a circle on top of the box. Offset it 1.5 inches. Push pull 1.5 inches downwards. Triple click to select and group. Select the box and delete as we do not require referencing anymore. Move and rotate the back as I am showing. If you are not aware of how to use these tools, you can check my previous tutorials in which I have covered the basics of SketchUp on iPad. Rotate the seat as well. Give a thickness to the circle that we copied and rotated. Double click on this group to edit. Select the circle, take follow me tool. Drag the smaller circle on the bigger circle to convert it into a tube. Repeat these steps for the side circle also. Move the geometry in place. Scale if required. Choose parallel projection and plan view from scenes panel. Move and copy to create remaining geometry. Now assign material. You can download assets from warehouse to complement with your model. Don't forget to subscribe if you like the tutorial and keep watching Design Gorithm. Bye bye.